It's around this time of year that many graduating seniors are recognized for their achievements during their educational careers. One well-known program in Great Falls is Excellence in Education, a means of recognizing high-performing seniors from Great Falls High, CMR, and Paris Gibson Education Center, as well as the educators who guided them along the way. MTN's Lindsay Hyatt tells us more. Each year, 34 students select two teachers who've helped them walk the path to success to be honored by the Great Falls Public Schools Foundation. Since the public won't be able to attend this year's ceremony in person, we're bringing their stories to you. That's three stories from each of the three high schools. Three students, six teachers, and one excellent education. CMR student Brayden Youngkin isn't your average high school senior. In high school, I kind of focused on honors classes and especially science-based. So chemistry, uh, physics, um, it, like intro to engineering, and I also focus quite a bit on math. In fact, the word average has never been associated with any of his many talents. Because he really excels in everything he does. He's an athlete, he plays an instrument. The challenge for students like Brayden is knowing how to best use all of their abilities. A lot of them get, um, they're perfectionists and they want to do everything well, so they need to learn to break out of that comfort zone. When Brayden met his gifted education teacher in first grade, she helped him hone his less used skills. He was such a math and science mind that I introduced him to public speaking and then he ended up doing very well with that too. So just trying to find other avenues for the, them to succeed in. She helped foster just a love for doing extra stuff. Speech competitions, science expos, and an ability to learn outside his comfort zone. And it was all because she just helped kind of foster that and helped me gain skills I definitely needed. Skills he'd carry with him out of the elementary school classroom and into the halls of his high school. Braden continued to excel and pursue his love of math and science throughout his educational career. And when he struggled to grasp AP calculus as a senior, his math teacher guided him through the material. I don't think I would understand calculus as well as I do without scare, uh, just because the way he explained things was so much better than the book could do. So much better that he plans to major in aeronautical engineering at MSU Bozeman next year, where he will continue to prove he is anything but average. The sky's the limit for you, and that is no pun intended whatsoever. He is truly one in a million. Uh, I think every teacher hopes they get somebody in their career like that. Thanks for everything that you've taught me, and I hope I've taught you just as much. In Great Falls, Lindsay Hyatt, MTN News. Well, and Braden is just one of several honorary CMR students designated within this year's Excellence in Education program. Tune in tomorrow night to hear how one Great Falls High student wouldn't let hearing impairment stop her from achieving academic excellence.